Welcome to the Axiom. New file detected. Launching file. How's it going, everybody? My name is Leo, and today we are continuing the Outer Wilds file. Where we last left off, we had uh, gone to the Addle Rock, where we found the... Um, we found someone whose name is currently escaping me. Hang on, it'll be in the ship's log. Um, rumor mode. Uh, Esker. We found uh, Esker, um, who uh, has been living up there for quite a while. And uh, we also found some Nomai ruins of some, some kind of device they were trying to... They had built to try and find something called the Eye of the Universe. Um, and then the sun exploded. Um, which was funny because it happened right as uh, right as I activate the device, so I thought I did it. Um, but no, the sun exploded, it, it reset our loop, um, and so we found uh, the ruins, we found some stuff pointing to um, Giant's Hollow. Uh, they were trying to build other things in, hang on, let's see. Brittle Hollow, yeah. Uh, they were trying to build a new device on Brittle Hollow, but we also found the uh, uh, Feldspar, his harmonica. Um, Feldspar is someone who went missing, who used to be part of the Outer Wilds venture, and his... Um, oh, I guess I... Huh, I can't pilot the ship in my suit. That's a little weird. Okay. But... Um, the sound of his harmonica is coming from two different places. It's coming from uh, the other side of the planet, and it's coming from the Dark Bramble. So we t we had touched down on the other side of the planet and died to uh, ghost matter. So I'm hoping that we are not going to do that again. Oh, boy. So what we're going to try to do is we're going to be a little more careful. Actually, what we can do... Is we can just go here and uh, we'll put on actually we won't waste this stuff on our spade suit we'll open the hatch what we're going to do instead where's my scout do I not have my scout unless I have my suit on okay I guess I don't have my scout unless I have my suit on um, okay yeah equip scout launcher so what we're going to do is we're actually going to check out this crater. Uh, and we're going to launch the scout. Whoops. Uh, so hang on. Well, let's launch the scout down here. Uh, rotate camera. Okay, this is a new area, so there isn't any uh, ghost matter down here. Let's really quick see. Huh, that actually looks like a piece of the dark bramble. And it seems to be coming from there. That's interesting. But let me go ahead and retrieve my scout. Um, and then let's go ahead and get down here instead of trying to... Uh... Oh, boy. Um, we'll go back to where we were before later. Right now, I want to check this out. Also, I was most definitely wrong about the 30-minute loop thing. I wasn't taking into account, um, like, the time it took me to get off the planet to begin with. So, I actually don't know how long the loops are. I'm hoping they're, like, just an hour or two. Because if they're longer than that, we might have a problem with how I end the episode. So, we'll see. But, uh, put away. So what is this? Talk to Tektite. Hey, you hatchling. Thought you were taking that tin can of yours into space today. What are you still doing here? Me? I saw something crash over the horizon and didn't like what I was seeing in the picture my little scout was sending back. So I thought I'd come over here myself and take a look. Is that a dark bramble seed? You think so? It's nothing I've ever seen on Timber Hearth before, so you're probably onto something there. Whatever it is, it's put down roots in a hurry. I don't like the look of this thing, Hatchling, and that's a fact. 
think I'll send Marl and Hal loose on it. Best get rid of this mess sooner rather than later, and no one can remove an unwanted plant faster than a tree keeper can. I'll have to get a look at what's inside the seed first, though. Don't want to set anybody to hacking up a potentially dangerous plant without a better idea of what's lurking inside there. Tuff can help me haul the old scout launcher over here. Obviously, the opening is too small for someone to fit inside, and anyway, I'm not going to blindly stick my hands into anything that looks as unpleasant as that seed does. That's a good way to lose an arm or two. Huh. Blasted seed did a lot of damage when it crashed. I liked this crater. Need something from me, hatchling? Uh, you're sure this season from Timber Hearth? Back in my younger days, I explored everywhere there is to go on Timber Hearth and saw everything there is to see, and then some. Trust me, we don't have anything like this. Am I still recording? Cool, I am. <laughs> nah, I reckon this thing's from Dark Bramble if it's from anywhere, Hatchling. Okay. So it is definitely... Coming from this. So I can send my scout inside the seed? Uh, sure. Error. Duplicate signal. Uh... What is that? Hang on. There's something down there. Let's see if I can... Can I land any better on it? It's like an angler fish. Hang on. I think I landed a bit better on it. Unless this is... Wait. Am I looking? Where did I actually launch it? What happens if I put it in this opening? I'm not seeing any, any ghost matter, so it might be safe. This doesn't look like anything I've ever seen. Yeah, there's there's something there. What does error duplicate signal mean? Huh. Okay. That's not creepy at all. Part of me wants to jump in, but part of me wants to save that for another time. Because I don't want to reset the loop too early. Or I don't want to risk resetting the loop too early. Um, let's go ahead and head back really quick. But let's go ahead and... Um, Am I stuck? I was definitely stuck for a second there. There we go. All right, let me go ahead and go back in. All right, so I updated the ship log. Let's go ahead and refuel. Dark Bramble Seed. Inside the seed. A seed from Dark Bramble crashed here and has already taken root. Tektite wants to know wants to use a scout launcher to get a look at what's inside. My signal scope picks up harmonica music when I aim it at the seed. I launched my little scout into the seed. Somehow the seed is much bigger on the inside. When I launch my scout into the seed that crashed on Timber Hearth, it ends up somewhere in Dark Bramble. Oh! 
So it teleported to Dark Bramble? Interesting. Okay. Um, but let's really quick... Uh, do the ghost matter thing. Okay, I can, um... Do it, do this while I'm in my suit. Uh, but let me go to map mode. Zoom... I guess there's not really a good way to do this. There's the geyser pools. I guess let's just lift off. And we're still in the gravity. But let me see if I can find where I had found that dark matter before. Or, you know what? Let's just go here. This seems promising. Uh, well, actually, something tells me I shouldn't... Oh, boy. Ah, 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 oh, boy. Okay. Oh, this is where I did the thing. Okay, okay, okay. Um, so let me actually go ahead and uh, land here. Ow. Am I steady? Okay, I didn't land on a steady surface exactly. Does my thing need repairs? Okay, um, it's fine. Are these no my bridges down here? Okay, I think I tried to get in by the waterfall, but let me really quick. Um, no, I think it's over there. Let me go ahead and really quick, in that case, um, whoops, oh, I took a picture of myself. Is this where I saw it? Oh. Oh, those crystals. Those crystals are ghost matter, or they have, um, why though? Are they protect? Let me rotate the camera really quick. Hang on, let me go ahead and fire it right there. Nope. Go. Oh boy, don't do that. Okay. So I think if I go around the water side, I might be safe, but... The question is, do I even need to go down here? I can't really see anything of note. So in that case... Yeah, there's a lot of the stuff right there. And I can't see a cave or anything over here. Although there's... Granted, there's a tree blocking my path. Or blocking my view. Let me go ahead and actually fire it from this direction. Fall, don't fall, don't fall. Okay, I don't think there's anything there. No, okay, it's just a thing. Unless there's something behind the waterfall. Nope. There is not, okay. So in that case, let's not go down there, because there's no need for us to go down there. Um, I'm trying to keep track of how long I've been recording so that I know when the cycle ends. What does the sun look like right now? Where is even the sun? Is it in that direction? It looks kind of bright in that direction. 
I mean, that doesn't have any color, so that doesn't help me. But as far as I know, there's no, there's nothing. Oh, wait, there are like pockets of it. Because there's some. That landed on a wall. Hang on, let me fire it a bit more up. Yeah, it's in a hazard right now. Okay, so I'll need to be careful. Let me see if there's a way. Oh, what's over here? Let me put this away, actually. I don't quite know where I am. Oh, that is very red. That's a lot. Well, I don't know. It looks orange in the recording, actually, so maybe it's not as red as I think it is. Um, oh, so these are like actual ruins. Uh, can I interact with this at all? That looks like it needs something. Oh. The heck is this? These all look like I need like pieces of something. Huh. Okay. So, there's that. Let's see what's over here. Let me equip my scout launcher to make sure I'm not going to run into any dangerous stuff. Huh. Yeah, there's some dangerous stuff down there. Let's try going down this way and around. I know not a whole lot has happened, but this is still very fascinating. Let me actually fire this down here. Do I see anything of value? I do. I don't. Let me go ahead and actually... Um... No, no. I didn't know there was a gap there. What is this? Huh. Can I take a picture of this? Is there a way for me to take a picture of this? Oh, okay, hang on, hang on, hang on. Let me... No. So there's a hole in a tree? That is all ghost matter. Am I supposed to look for this specific tree? Also, how do I get back up? Um, hang on. Am I about to walk into more ghost matter? No. Hey, that's me. Oh, I think the sun's about to blow up. Is that the noise the sun makes? It's yep. All right, I don't have much time. Ghost matter detected nearby. Okay, let me get in. Um, okay, so I have... Okay, so I'm at about 25 minutes. So actually, my assumption might have been right. It might be, um... Get me out of the water, please. I can't see.
the heck? Okay, so I can't get through that log. Um... Alright, there doesn't seem to be anything down here. And I'm about to die. Jeez, that's insane. That effect is really cool. So, there had to be something down there, right? Unless I'm wrong about that? So, yeah. Not counting when I... Because I started the recording a few minutes in. So I have about, I'd say like 25, 25, 30 minutes, maybe even just 20 minutes after I put in the, in the launch codes before the sun supernovas. So let me go ahead. Let me go back in. So actually, my initial prediction might not have been so far off. Let me get in the suit. What was that? Gear options? Oh, no, I don't need that. Um, whoops, rumor mode. Um, let's go ahead and... Uh, get back to where we were. So we explored the crater. We ex we didn't explore the geyser, but I'm not sure if I want to yet. What does the top of the geyser look like? Oh, holy crap. I'm just getting a little lay of the land here right now. Huh, there's something there as well. Uh, I wish I could... Uh, there's something here. That looks like an outpost. Oh, and I think there's actually someone there. No, there's a... At the very least, there's... Um, some sort of observatory there. These are the mountains. The geyser mountains. And we are back at the crater. Okay, so... First things first. Let us... What is over here? Oh, this is Timber Hearth. Uh, okay. Hmm. Okay, so let me... Inside that geyser seemed like an interesting place to start. So actually, let me... Go ahead and touch down... I'm going to have to be very careful. Is this even a geyser? Does it erupt? Nope. No, no, no. Actually, so I want to... No, no. Oh, I'm upside down. That's not good. So 
So where the heck am I? Does any of the thing need repairs? Does not look like it. Um, untranslated Nomai writing. Mining site 2B. Oh. Hang on. I'm not sure I want to open that yet. Is there anything further down? No, it's just, it just doesn't look like it. It looks like I'll die if I do that. What is over here? And am I going to die? Oh, this is the other side of the bridge. Right? Hang on, let me... Okay. I think this is the other side of the bridge. Um... Yeah, I was just down there. Okay. Let me put this away. Are there any signals? That's Esker. Okay. So, the reason why you can hear the harmonica coming from the seed is because it leads to Bramble Hollow. So we have mining site 2B, huh? What is this? What is this? Do we have signals here? That's Esker. Uh, let's equip our flashlight. Um... No, 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 Am I about to die? What is happening? Am I in zero G? I am in zero G. Oxygen tank refilled. Oh no, I'm in water. That's what's happening. I'm not in zero G, I'm in water. Huh. What happens if I try to go through one of these things? Nothing, okay. What happens if I, what is this? Something I can't get into. All right, let me, those look hot. So let me go ahead and get up here. Whoops. Huh. Can I? Where does this lead me? These are you no know, my skeletons, it looks like. Was this never found? This has to have this had to have been found, right? That looks like it leads around. I don't know. Huh, that leads down. Oh, that leads to where I was, I think. Oh, no. Oh, no. I'm still amazed by how much ore the Ash Twin Project requires. Kaisad. Isn't this the ore for the remaining... T isn't this the ore for the remaining towers being built on Ash Twin? The completed towers I've seen are quite large. 
Oeno. No, the material for those towers is all being taken from Ash Twin. The ore we're mining here will be used to craft an immensely thick protective shell that will physically seal off the chamber inside Ash Twin's core. Coleus. I'm relieved by our clan's decision to use Timber Hearth's ore only for constructing the shell. If, eventually, life on this planet were to evolve to the point of advanced metallurgy, I'm confident we won't have destroyed their ability to create. What does that mean? Sai Kaisad. If they're sealing off all entrances, I hope they've planned, planned a core accordingly. Uh, the Nomai still had puns, apparently. I thought you had forbidden your apprentice from making puns, Coleus. How else would he improve? Huh. So they were building towers on Ash Twin, huh? And then what is over here? Pick up Ash Twin Projection Stone. Which goes there. And what is this? Nothing? There's something that goes here too. Let's put it in here first. Yero. My gratitude for the latest shipment, Oneo. O Oeno. This ore should be the last we'll need for the Ash Twin project. Yero, once we finish the shell that seals off the central chamber, we'll check to ensure there are no longer any physical entrances. Raimi and I will be checking the interior and then the, the exterior for cracks, our final safety check. Oh, I know. This is exciting news. Can I offer an extra set of eyes for this final check, specifically mine? If my work here is complete, I'll be delighted to help. Yero, we'd be grateful if you would. The more eyes, the better, as the smallest flaw or opening in the shell that protects the Ash, that protects the Ash Twin project could, could lead to disaster. Ship log updated. What happens if I put that in here? What the heck? What is happening? Oh. Interesting, okay. Okay, that was weird. Was that the Nomai looking at me? Um... Actually, let me... I didn't look up. Can I interact with these things at all? No, okay. So they're just looking at me. Um... Interesting. Okay. So, I guess let me go back to the ship. Can I actually... I'm going to take this with me. Or, no, I, I guess I can't. Um, let me go ahead and... Can I put it back on the... Put it back where I found it. Um, so, there's something here... They were trying to build some kind of towers on the Hourglass Twins. Something called the Twin Ash Project. And, um... And I think my loop is done. Nope, no, no. Oh, I was so close. Can I even get out of here? 
Oh, I can. Holy crap. But still, I think my... Ow. But still, I think my uh, legs are broken. I think my thing's about to come to an end. Um, is there anything worth getting down there? I doubt it. it. It looks like all those platforms are blank. So let me go ahead and leave. See what my ship has to say about this. Yeah, something tells me we're about to supernova. Now, my mind's Ash Twin Project. Then, on my mind, orphan the site to craft a protective shell designed to physically seal off the central chamber inside Ash Twin. Once the shell was finished, the Nomai checked to ensure there were no longer any physical entrances or cracks. The central chamber inside Ash Twin was physically sealed off by an immensely thick protective shell. Um, okay, so that is something... So it looks like we have two stories going on right now. Um, let me go ahead and leave. Um, there's a couple more places that need to be checked. Although something tells me I don't have a lot of time left. Oh yeah, I don't have a lot of time left. So let me... Let's see, there's the crater, there's the mountains. Um... Okay, there's this. What is this? Nope, I did not mean to land on this stump. Uh, okay. Unbuckle. Pretty sure we're about to supernova, so I want to try to look at this quickly. Uh, never mind. Um... Because I think I think we found everything on the Adel Rock, so I want to see if I can find everything on here as well. Chert's research notes: property of Chert. I've detected a strange so signal coming from somewhere within the grove in this crater. It's very similar to the signal emitted by the quantum moon, so it stands to reason the two signals are probably related. We don't know much about the quantum moon, seeing as no one's ever been able to land on it, but hopefully studying the signal in the grove will reveal more about it. Okay, so there's a signal somewhere in here? Hang on. It's not that, is it? Is it something else? Hang on. Uh, okay. It's not that. Is it coming from in here? That's Esker. Unidentified signal nearby. Huh. Is that another statue? Hang on, let me... Really quick. Or is that the tree? Hang on, what does this sign say? What do these signs say? Oh. It's always dark, the quiet shade, across old bark in the ancient glade. It's, like, right there. Whoops. It's coming from that. Oh!
Are you one of those stones that move? You are. Wait a minute. Oh God. Um. So the position of the sign, that's why I thought I had moved towards the sign and it was no longer there because it, I looked away and it changed on me. So it's always dark in the ancient glade. Oh, wait a minute. And the signs have re rearranged themselves. It's always dark in the ancient glade, across old bark, the quiet shade. Hang on, so maybe I need to unscramble this. Um, in the ancient glade, uh, it's always dark, the quiet shade, across old bark, maybe? Yeah, so... That's creepy. What happens if I keep spinning? Um, so I have to like, maybe if I, let's get in the center. Huh. Maybe if I... Come on, get... No, screw it. <laughs> we haven't supernova yet, which is weird. Grove shard. Frequency discovered. Quantum fluctuations. Okay. Ship log updated. So can I leave? Still? So I discovered a frequency. Qu quantum fluctuations. Let's see what the ship's log has to say. Why can't I jump this gap? Excuse me. Okay. <laughs> There's a strange rock shard in this grave, in this grove, that moves when I'm not watching. It emits a signal on the quantum fluctuations frequency. I found a poem written on one of the trees in the grove. Shirt's research notes mention a quantum moon that no Harthian has been able to land on, probably because it moves. But maybe with the signal I can find it? I mean, it doesn't matter. Hang on. So yeah, we are about to... do this once again. So that's the grove. Huh. I kind of want to watch it just to see it happen. Oh, wow. That is insanely cool. Like, that is... Th that is such a spectacle. That's really awesome. Where even am I that I'm able to avoid it for this long? Huh.
Okay, so... Did I, did I see it? Was that everything on Timber Hearth? Let me go ahead and do this. Let me go ahead and buckle up one more time. Let me see if I can... The last place I haven't explored yet is the Geyser Mountains. And then there's that place. Which is super weird. Is that... So... That is definitely the entrance to the mines. Don't know if there's anything useful down there, though. That cave is full of... Whoa. That cave is full... Oh, it's still pulling me in with gravity. That place is full of ghost matter, so I don't know if there's anything useful over there. Um... Let's see. That's Timber Hearth. Let's go ahead and go to the Geyser Mountains. Let's go ahead and downward thrust. Let's see if there's anything to see over here. I don't know where I would land though. Maybe just take a look from here. It, there doesn't seem to be anything on the mountains themselves. Let's see. I'll land here on the ground. And then let's go ahead and... I don't think there's really any way for me to climb up. Except for using my jetpack booster. Let's see. I guess I could see what's in them after they stop erupting. Let's see if there's anything in here. Uh... Oh, I can't even. Oh, there's a current. Well, hopefully, uh... This lets out somewhere. Uh, where am I? Oh, this is still underwater. Um, so that let me out. So this is another current. Let's go in here, I guess. Where is this going to take me? Oh. Coleus, after closer observation, mining site 2A wouldn't be safe for the native life dwelling in some of these ca this cave's pools, so unfortunately we'll have to mine one of the other sites. There are a few other cave sites that look promising. What about site 2B? It shares similar formations and strata. This sounds promising. Will you and your mentor investigate? If mining site 2B proves safe for this native species, we'll move our work there. Let me get more in here. 
Site 2B is safe. Coleus says we'll continue to monitor our activity and its effect on life here. On the opposite hand, new life. The species is semi-aquatic and very hardy. The ecosystem here is quite robust, so I believe they'll thrive in the long run. Be cautious near the pools if you visit 2A to meet them. Uh, okay. They remind me of a subterranean species that my mentor, Melore, once told me about from when our clan used to travel across the universe. I imagine she would have enjoyed these life forms greatly. I was watching them once during a rest, and the hours escaped from me. They're fascinating. I wonder what their fourth eye does. Oh, they were studying us. So we were subterranean? Ship log updated. So they watched us evolve. I came in through there. Oh, that leads out to Site 2B. Well, hang on, where does this lead then? I have to keep my oxygen in mind, but I think I'm doing okay so far. Although I seem to be going further underground, which doesn't bode well. This looks modern. This looks like there was someone here. Was this not underwater at some point? Like, this doesn't... This looks like there was someone living here. can't read any of the papers. Is there any... S We're right by the bramble seed. Put away... Does that say Outer Wilds Venture? I think it does. Sardines. Yeah, someone definitely made their camp here. Was it Feldspar? So where do I come out? Because it doesn't look like I, I can interact with any- Oh, wait a minute, wait, wait, wait. What is this? I am running out of oxygen, so I'll need to make sure I keep that in mind. About halfway. I'm assuming there isn't much more. Okay, now I'm officially... I don't think I went up high enough to actually get away. Oh boy. Okay, I think it's sending me back through the loop, but at least I got my oxygen refilled. Hang on, okay, let me just take this one up. Uh, where am I? Uh... Oh, I am in space right now. And I am landing. Let me just... Oh, boy. I definitely died. <laughs> or broke something. Is there a reason why my icon is red? Let me get back to the ship. That was cool. That really paid off. That was... Yeah, that was insanely cool. Um, the only place I haven't really had the chance to figure out is the one with all the ghost matter. Let me, really quick, one more time, try to go there and see if anything comes of that. Because I didn't really get the chance to explore it in much detail because of the... Thing. Okay, so health and fuel. Oh, I have. Oh, I have health. So I was close to death. Um. 
The Nomai discovered a species of four-eyed semi-aquatic light forms in the waterways near the mine. Okay. So let me... Go ahead. I do have to end the episode soon. So... Just let me see if I can find that spot again. I have a master alarm on my thing. Oh, there, there's a damage detector. I just realized that on the, <laughs> the bottom left of my screen is a damage detector. So I don't have to guess whether or not I have a damage. Is this it? Is this what I'm looking for? No. Hang on. Okay, so this is it. We land here. Whoops. All right, let me try going here again. Because there has to be something here. There has to be something down here that I'm missing. Because I saw literally nothing except for the ghost matter. But it has to be here. Like, something has to be here. They wouldn't just have nothing here. There don't seem to be ghost crystals, like... Right here. No, 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 that's too far. Oh my god, okay, so... What is here? Because if I go through here, I can get around the ghost matter, right? Come on, get... Get up. Huh. It doesn't look like there's anything here. Okay. Let me see if I can... Oh, boy. No. Oh, my God. <laughs> Let me see if I can try to find a safe way down. That doesn't involve me uh, going splat. Okay. Oh, boy. Nope. I'm going splat. Okay, so... There has to be something here. Like, those... Those, uh, like, maze pieces at the top seemed like they needed some kind of... Um... Piece. And I would imagine... It would be down here somewhere. Where's the ghost matter? Oh, it's right there. Oh, it's also here. There's nothing down here except you, but you look like you could have... You were something. Yeah, let's just go ahead and go back, I guess. I'm not really finding anything. I'm sure there's something down here that I'm missing, but I just don't know where it could be. Is there a signal somewhere? That's not it. Any quantum anything? Uh, no. Any? No. Okay. Let me put this away. All right, so with that, I think we're going to go ahead and end today's episode. Um, it was definitely a fascinating one. Uh, I say that a lot when it comes to the games that I play. Fascinating. But, um, yeah, like this one, it's really cool how the exploration works and how you, like, nothing is really considered off the beaten path because you can literally go anywhere and you'll always find something cool around the next corner. Um, like I said, I have a feeling I'm missing something in this area, but uh, I don't know how to find it right now. So I'm just going to 
probably move on to one of the other planets. Um, I don't know exactly which one yet, but uh, I'll decide that when I get to the next episode. I'll probably let this uh, loop finish out and I'll let the sun explode without doing anything so I can start next episode with uh, fresh with a new loop. Um, so yeah, look forward to whatever I decide to do in the future. So uh, yeah, thank you everybody so much for checking out the video. I really do appreciate it. If you want to be notified of when I upload the next part of the file to the archives, go ahead and hit the subscribe button and ring that bell, as well as leave a like or comment if you so desire. Thanks again, and I will see you next time. Upload successful. Click here to view previous files. Have a pleasant day.